All right, guys, now here we are with a very quick overclocking preset for the i7 8086K on a Z590 ASRock Phantom Gaming ITX. Now, 90% of the i7 8086K will hit 5.1 GHz, so I copy my settings, but if you are lucky, you might get 5.2. I will give you a preset for that too. Now, let's get straight into it. So, you just log into the BIOS, go to CPU ratio, all core, set it to 52. If this doesn't work, set it to 51 or vice versa. Of course, 51 is gonna be easier to work than 52, but anyway. Now, go down here, keep CPU cache ratio. I recommend you start with 47, then you can work your way up, but I will tell you later on in the video. Now, you go down there, you unlock all the limits, so long duration power limit, just hit like 999 until like you can unlock it. Uh, and all of those, just unlock them. Now, go on to voltage. Uh, you basically wanna go to uh, here and set a manual fixed voltage of 1.375 on your CPU. And then as a load line calibration, you want to have two, which is, as you can see by uh, the graph, the second highest. So if it works in reverse in your motherboard, you wanna have say four, but here it's two. So the second most flat, okay? You wanna have the least angle possible. Now you go uh, down here and this is basically it for the preset. So it's done, overclocking done. Now, if you wanna keep watching, I will tell you a couple of tips and tricks now. If you don't have an insane RAM overclock, okay, say if you have under 3600 megahertz, copy those settings, they will help you lower your power, okay? So just go here, set 1.1 on the VCC IO, and then go here, set 1.15 on the VCC system agent. If this makes your system unstable, do this. 1.2 here, 1.15 here. If this still doesn't work, you can try this one, 1.25, okay? Uh, you won't need higher, trust me. Okay, then back onto the CPU configuration. For the cache, you can go as high as uh, I'd say 49, but this will require a little bit more voltage. So test it out. Don't go higher than three minus than the CPU because it's not really gonna be worth the voltage in general. Okay, now if you have this setting, FCLK frequency, please set it to one gigahertz. It's gonna give you free performance, so do that. And that's about it, for real. Fairly easy, this doesn't work. Set 51, it's gonna work on every, basically, i7, 86K. Take care, bye.